months and we launched in like January, the end of January, 2017. And we were different, looking at different ways. And I was looking at bottles, obviously. And, you know, it was when I was uh, talking with a uh, store's owner, they were saying, well, the problem is bottles. We we have those and we can't recycle them. And then I was talking with uh, companies that are doing recycle. And I realized that all, uh, the recycling of bottles in Quebec was very low. It was about 7 or 8% at that time. Really? It, gone up to maybe 16 now, but it's still okay. very low, right? Right. I was like, and while I was in Nicaragua and uh, Central America, I saw all the <clears> impact <throat> of, you know, plastic that, on the environment. And I was like, why don't we try to do something a bit more eco-friendly? So we started to do our kombucha on tap. So we, I purchased like, you know, a couple of fridges and we started installing those fridges and we do kegs and stuff like that. So people would go, I started with four filling station the first week and like people would go in the stores and fill the bottles and then, you know, come back. Mm -hmm. I was like, all right, you know, we'll start like that with four and then we'll see. And then things just start, you know, rolling. And the next week we had 10 and then, you know, 15. And within a couple of months we had 50 and things were going very good. So much that, you know, after two weeks, I was like, all right, okay. Like I was brewing in my apartment. Like a lot of people start like a small business, right? Yeah. You don't know, you know, what's going to happen. So you don't go renting a big yeah. place. Yeah. And after two, he's like, okay, this doesn't make sense. You know? <laughs> Holy crap. What am I yeah. doing here? <laughs> and 